Hello everybody and welcome back to the Wattpad Book Club. My name is Phoenix and uh, once again I am joined with Kenzie. <laughs> Hello! I'm so glad to be back once again! Yeah, you're, you're like becoming one of my regulars now. <laughs> you're just yeah. always popping up! <laughs> right? <laughs> so, uh, the wheel has spoken in a horrible- like, well, the first time it's spoken it was absolutely horrible. <laughs> it was my yeah. pick again. <laughs> And I'm like, I don't know if I have the strength to do this anymore. <laughs> so I, I asked uh, Kenzie here uh, two very simple questions. Uh, one was if they wanted a ship or an X reader, and they pick ship. And then my second question was if they wanted lesbian, gay, or straight, and they pick lesbian. And yep. um, I did a thing, and you're going to be really surprised by it. I did this. <laughs> yeah. Um, we are going to be oh. running Test and Alley today. <laughs> oh my gosh! Yes! Let's go! <laughs> I went yes. to the liberty of translating this entire book for us to read. <laughs> oh my gosh, yes! So, no, I, 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 <laughs> I knew you would be excited! <laughs> I love this! I love this! I love this ship so much! <laughs> Yeah, but uh, th this is from, uh, I I will have the original link down below, and I also have the translated one for all the English readers out there as well. Uh, I was, I'll make it so after this, they won't be able to edit it, it's just for viewing purposes, so. But I recommend supporting the original author, because they did a good job. It's just, yes. I don't know how to read Spanish. <laughs> yeah, me neither. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh... I, I don't remember the title of this. I just titled this Tess Alley Translated Story. So there. <laughs> but uh well I have the original linked. Let me see if like what the title was of this. <laughs> Did, well it's from Harem the Goat. Yeah. So the title of this was T Alley X Tess Fanfiction in Spyro de Camp Campamento. <laughs> So, yeah. and then I don't even know how to read that description. I didn't <laughs> translate that, so <laughs> here we are. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Uh, I cannot wait. So same. Um. So from what I skimmed, like while well, well, while I was translating, because I had to kind of skim to make sure some things were right. So um, Tess and Allie are here, obviously, because it is a ship about them. Uh, yeah. Rosa Maria, Lake. Connor and Yule, and then yeah. we have the like the narrator kind of stuff. Yes. So, uh, do, I don't remember exactly what our roles were. Was, wasn't I Allie and you Tess? Yeah. 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 But I don't remember like anything else. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, do you want to? I mean, I can read for um, probably Lake and Yule, and then you can read for Rosa and Connor. Okay. Okay, that'd sure. probably be good. Okay, and then I'll do the narrator's it's crap. <laughs> okay. All right. Let's let's see. At least this time I don't have to flip my credit card in the air to see who gets to go first. <laughs> True. <laughs> right. <laughs> At the tenth episode of Camp Disventure, following Rosa Maria's devastating elimination, Ali and Tess were shocked when Ria's betrayal was revealed, but it was to be expected for Rosa to arrive at the hotel to see her best friend Lake, and for Allie and Tess welcome, welcomes her with open arms and regrets her recent removal. Allie was very sad and could not sleep, and wakes up in the middle of the, middle of the morning- I think that's supposed to be the middle of the night. <laughs> Oops. Right. Oopsies. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Tess wakes up. Hey Allie, are you alright? Looking out the window at night. <laughs> I don't know, Tess. It's because of Rosa, right? Yeah, she didn't deserve something like that. I thought I had everything to win, but Rhea gets angry. How could she do that to her? And here I thought we knew her, but we don't know her very well. Easy, Allie. I can understand your frustration, too. Even I thought that bitch was someone very nice and kind. <laughs> that she was, that she was behind the whole game from day one, and we never noticed. <laughs> Just as a side note, it will appear later on, but uh, I was translating this one part, and like, uh, after translating, this like, one part of it stayed in Spanish. I'm like, why yeah. is that? So like, I, I was like, maybe if I erase the bottom stuff that was already translated, 
maybe I can figure out what it was. Uh, it translated to motherfucker. <laughs> it was so funny just saying that. I'm like, oh, now I know the Spanish word for a uh, motherfucker. <laughs> That's hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it. We thought she was a nice person, but of course, like an actress, she was faking it all the time until she revealed her true colors. What a fool I was. I never should have made an alliance with her to get Lake out that day. Allie, listen to me. Rhea saw the stupid faces of all of us, including the two of us. None of us- none of, none of that was your fault. Calm down. Hugs her and kisses her. It's okay, Tess, and thanks again for making me feel better. Come on, we have to sleep. <laughs> yeah, we better go to bed. Early tomorrow we are going to welcome Rosa. You know what? Come to think of it, we shouldn't include Rhea in our future group of friends. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Wow. I mean, that's yeah. fair. That's, that's really fair. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Poor Rhea, though. Yeah. <laughs> I, I agree. Not 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 after what she did to Rosa. Now n now more than ever she needs us. Allie and Tess fall asleep and Rosa Maria arrives at the hotel and knocks on the door of Lake's room. Hello? Lake? Opens the door. Oh Rosa hugs her very tightly. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of that in there. Yeah. <laughs> I missed you a lot, friend. I miss you a lot too, and I'm really sorry about your elimination. It must have been very devastating. Begins to cry. <laughs> Lake, Lake, Lake was horrible. Everyone there saw me as a thief. Well, except Hunter. He did believe me unlike the rest. Exactly. Hunter is a very good person, just like Tess and Allie, but I can't say the same about Rhea. Cry furiously. Rhea! That ass snake betray betrayed me right down and she didn't even regret having done it. Now I hate that asshole. I hate her a lot. I love the cussing. <laughs> it's so funny. Same. Don't worry, Rosa. <laughs> I really understand your frustration. I also really disliked how Rhea betrayed you. I have no intention of calming down, Lake. Just thinking about Rhea makes me want to grab her until she is unrecognizable. Damn. <laughs> Rosa, please calm down. Do it for me, I implore you. <laughs> what? I think it's supposed to be I beg you. But, yeah. But it, it'd be really proper. <laughs> yeah. Calms down. It, 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 it's, it's okay. I'm calm now. Well, tell me, Lake, how have you been? Okay, well, actually better now that I was making friends with Tess and Allie here. Wow, Lake. That's really cool. And what did you and what did you talk to them about while you were at camp? Well, they have suggested to, to me to make a group of friends and I agreed to do it and I wanted to ask you if you want to be a part of it. It's a great idea, Lake. And yes, I'm in. I also want to be in the group of friends. From the beginning, I've always I've always wanted to meet Ali and Tess, even when I was on their team for a while. But Rhea made it difficult for me, but unlike the treacherous viper, the two of them are very honest and with hearts of gold, and when I was with Hunter, I imagined that it would be a great opportunity to form a friendship with Allie and Tess. I'm very happy that you also ex accept to be part of the group along with me, Tess, and Allie. Rosa, hey, by the way, now that you deeply hate Rhea, I took the liberty of doing this. Shows, shows her a pillow with Rhea's photo to, to for, beat her up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, the, I think the gra I think the translator yeah, messed up the grammar doopsie. a bit. <laughs> yep. <laughs> okay. Thanks. Thanks, Lake. Thanks, Lake. Now I can get even with Rhea for playing crooked with crooked with me. I think cro I meant to say crook, but <laughs> grabs the, grabs the pillow with Rhea's photo on it and starts to hit it so furiously. <laughs> Motherfucker! <laughs> this is for making me believe a thief and turning the, the rest against me, and this is also for betraying me and stealing my totem. I hate you, asshole. Go to hell! Jeez! Stop, Rosa, <laughs> from continuing to hit the pillow. <laughs> okay, Rosa, I think that's enough. 
<laughs> yes, it is. We better have to sleep tomorrow. We have a lot to do with Tess and Allie now that we're together. We'll be, we'll be best friends. Is that okay with you? <laughs> yeah, she's like, yes. Yeah, is it okay if we just become friends with them? Yeah. <laughs> Calm down. Yes, Blake. I can't wait to get to know Allie and Tess better. Hey, and where and where are Mackie and Kai? I have no idea. Tess and Allie don't know what happened to them either, but they're just as worried as I am. Yeah, they're just chilling in the woods. They're fine. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. I pray to I pray to Dioc though. I guess that means God. That that they are both okay. It would be a great tragedy if something if something happened to them. Well, you have to sleep. Rest, Lake. Yes, Rosa. Same. <laughs> Let me just God. Okay. <laughs> Rosa, Maria, and Lake fall asleep and sleep in the same bed. The, <laughs> the next what? one. Yeah, I guess. I don't think they mean it in that way, though. That, that which okay. is good. <laughs> oh, okay. The next morning, Allie and Tess wake up and start talking about how to how to start making the group of friends with Rosa and Maria. Now that their best friend Lake was in total agreement to be part of it and to integrate Rosa and Maria. Hi, Tess. Good morning. Good morning, Allie. Good morning, Allie. You look very beautiful today. Oh, yo, they're being gay together. Pug. <laughs> oh. oh. You too. Well, you only tell me because I'm in love. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Not just for that, but because I'm in love too. <gasps> With the romance. <laughs> Well, that's very nice, and nice to hear that. Thank you. It's okay, my love. Everything is to make your day more <laughs> I love this book. <laughs> You're sweet. Hey, do you, th do you think- Wait, how do you think Rosa is? I'm sure she's fine. She has, like, support. Yeah, that's right. But, like you said last night, she needs us now more than ever. You're right. We should go to Lake's room to see them. They knock on the door of Lake's room. I think that won't be necessary anymore. I'll go- I'll go to open. Open's door. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Allie and Tess. Hello, Lake and Rosa. <laughs> Girls, is it possible? What? What's possible? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay, um, sure, go ahead. Rosa, we're very sorry about what happened to you. Compared to our eliminations, yours was what much worse. I, n I know, that was the most humiliating thing I'd ever ha that ever had happened to me before. We know, and we have found out everything. Rhea, ha Rhea has to pay for them. Yes, I don't like her her betrayal of Rosa at all. Just thinking about her makes me want to grab her at the point of a blow. <laughs> we understand you, Rosa. Even I thought she was a good person, too, but she was pretending to, to be from the beginning. Connor must be pretty devastated after seeing her true colors. <laughs> I imagine so. I imagine so, and the four of us are in the same situation as him and Rosa. You got the worst of it. I know, Tess, and I thought she was my friend, and I thought I would I would help her with everything she needed, but she was just using me, and she framed me for stealing things I didn't steal, I didn't steal, and she stole my totem. I'm so sorry I didn't tell you that, but we were on opposite sides. Don't worry, we were just doing our roles in the game. But it was to be expected, don't worry. Yes, sooner or later something like this had to happen. Yes, Rosa. Even though our time at camp, we were on two sides of the story. It's never too late for the four of us to be friends now that none of us are there. Oh, that's it's nice. It's true! Yeah, that's, that is really nice. It's true! And speaking of that, Lake told me that they were thinking of making a group of friends, and yes, I absolutely want to be a part of it too. Oh, Good job, Rosa. Now we can take advantage of this time so the four of us can be the best of friends forever. Aww! This is so cute! Yo, friendship! Friendship arc! 
<laughs> yep. Friendship Park, let's go! At first we thought about including Rhea too, but she doesn't deserve it. Not after what Rosa did to you. Exactly, Rosa. The betrayal she did to you was unforgivable. She will have to work harder to win our friendship and also our trust if she does. That's right, friend. Hey, Allie, can I talk to you alone, please? Sure, Rose. Uh, and Tess, lay, wait for us here? Yeah. Allie and Rosa Maria leave uh, Tess's room and enter Lake's room. I guess <laughs> that was a translation thing. Oops. It's fine. Yep. <laughs> okay, Rosa. What would you like to talk to me about? First, I want to get to know you better. I want to get to know you better, Ali, and then Tess. Believe it or not, you always seemed like a very nice person from the beginning. Aw, shucks. Thanks. <laughs> Aw. <laughs> Thank you, Rosa. You've always seemed very nice to me, too, when I met you. Do you know something, Ali? The first time I saw you before arriving at the camp, I said to myself, That girl will surely be my friend. But things got very complicated. First, we were on opposite teams, but then... But then when they changed me to your team, I, I had a chance, but then but then there was there was Rhea and she had another chance in the merger. So we could be friends. But the but but the things got, got worse regarding alliances, and it only led to our downfall. I understand you, Rosa. I also thought about being your friend from the first day, and yes, you were very right. First things got complicated when we got opportunities. And then they finally started to get worse. But hey, at least we are together, not in camp, but in this hotel, and things will be better with the two of us in Tassa and Lake. No. Yes, Sally, you are absolutely right too. Listen, I am very sorry for having expelled expelled you before me. What happened to you was very unfortunate. You you had even more to give in the camp, just like me. Don't worry, Rosa. It was something that had to happen, but don't feel guilty. If I had stayed longer, the same thing would have happened to you. It might have happened to me, but much worse. Oh, uh, that is... Yeah, she's got a point. Yeah. <laughs> One of the last things I told Rhea before getting on the bus was that she might she might win the mi the million, but she'll be alone again, and that the game that the game had changed her. But when but when I said that, I felt very hypocritical because. The same thing happened to me. I mean, I got Tess expelled and then you, Allie. I understand you. The game has changed all of us. I also got Lake eliminated, but I didn't do it for revenge. That's not for me. I just thought she turned out to be the strongest. There. <laughs> it, it's okay. That doesn't ma that doesn't matter now, Allie. I, I don't hold any grudges against you for, for having done that. Losing a friend is very painful, but it was a matter of time before we could meet and create new ties. It's true. Now that none of none of the four of us are at camp, we can take the opportunity to grow our friendship like never before. Yeah, that's right! Hey, can I tell you something? Sure, tell me. The day on the bench, I was listening to your conversation with, with Tess about your tattoo, and, and, and I found it very emotional how you were telling her about your late grandfather. It touched my heart. He must have been very important to you and losing him must have been a very hard blow for you. Yes, it was. My grandfather meant a lot to me and it because of... Wait, <laughs> sorry. My grandfather meant a lot to me. It was because of him that I know everything I know about gaming and geek culture and the day that he passed away from lung cancer was one of the most devastating moments of my entire life. Life compared to the elimination of Tess and myself, I have not been able to stop crying, and I have not left the house then. That's why I entered the camp to distract myself from the emotional troubles. At first, I didn't need the million, but when I, but when I burnt my consoles, I needed it to at least replace them. Aww. What the fuck? Is this like, I know like her grandfather dying is canon, but was it actually lung cancer, or are they just like throwing that in there? I think it actually was lung cancer. Oh. I think it was actually implied. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> oh. Girl, how much money are you drawing on these consoles that you need a million dollars to replace? <laughs> right. Holy shit! A switch is like what three hundred dollars? Yeah. How how much switches do you need? 
<laughs> right? Hmm. Anyway. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm really sorry, Allie. It's okay, Rosa. Things aren't always as you expect them to be. Would you like to show me your tattoo, please? Sure. Takes off the left arm sleeve of her jacket and rolls up the short sleeve to show Rosa Maria the number the number two player tattoo. Hold Allie's left arm. Wow! Hey, that's cool! Yeah, thank you very much, Rosa. You're welcome, friend. Hey, there's something I'd like to show you. Shows her shows her a photo of Sophia from her cell phone. Aww, that's so cute. Ooh, yeah. Wow. Who's that beautiful little girl? She's my daughter, Sophia. Daughter? But aren't you too young to be a mom? I know. Lake also told me that before. You you will see. <laughs> I think that meant you see. Oh, oh my god. It's like the fucking Darman thing. It's like, you see, and you then see? I get into the fucking book. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you see, three years ago, I got pregnant when I was 16. Just like her. Just like her? Uh, okay. I don't think that- I don't think they meant to like- <laughs> Yeah. Oops. Like, yep. <laughs> At first I wasn't ready to carry that burden and I had to make a very tough decision. Putting her life at risk and maybe mine too. But when I gave birth to Sophia, it was the best thing that ever happened to me and changed my life completely. That's why I needed the millions to raise funds for my little girl's future. Oh. Damn it! All these characters have like sad backstories. They really do. Tess is like an orphan. Lake's yeah. like a parents are like super controlling. Rosemary is a yeah. teen mom. Allie's grandfather died. Right. <laughs> All these girls have trauma. <laughs> right. Oh my! I'm so sorry to hear that, Rosa. No, Allie. Don't apologize. Anyway, it wasn't your fault. It was Rhea's that ruined all my hopes. With the pain of the betrayal, Rosa Maria suddenly burst into tears and began to cry. Oh, too sad. What the fuck? Right? Uh, Rosa, what's wrong? Are you okay? Crying. No, Allie. It hurts a lot. What does? Crying. Rhea's betrayal. I trust her and I've been by her side, but I only let myself be carried away by that asshole's lies. How could she do this to me after all I did for her? I thought we were friends, but she was just using me all the fucking time to get far in the game. I know what I said. I know. I know what I said. I'm disappointed in her, but I'm seriously pissed that pissed off at her. I understand you, Rosa. Tess and I also got very angry because of what Rhea did to you, and even Lake was also very upset. Crying. I imagine so, but now what the hell am I going to do? My daughter needs me and I can't go home. My parents don't my parents don't don't want to see me even in pictures. Damn. Do you also have problems with your parents? Crying. Yes, they did not agree that I should have Sophia and I did not receive any support from both of them. I had to take I had to take care for her in in her first two years of life and before I went to I went to the camp, I left her in the hands of one of my friends. Don't worry, Rosa. When the show ends, Lake, Tess, and I will help you to provide a better future for your daughter. I promise. Oh! I love these guys! This is so awesome! <laughs> Wipes her tears. Thank you very much, Allie. And what problems do you have with your parents? Well, actually, I've never been able to have a good relationship with them since the day my grandfather passed away. They were always very distant with me, and my grandfather was very close until the day he, he the day he left. Oh! Why all these people got fucking mommy and daddy issues? For real? <laughs> oh my gosh! I am very sorry, Ali. I, I I know that sometimes the family is very complicated, but it is the most import, important important and most sacred thing that each person has. I know. It's never too late to give a second chance. Lake also had problems Lake also had problems with her parents because they controlled every aspect of her and wanted her to follow the same standards as them. <laughs> well, in Tess, she doesn't know if she ever had a family. She's been an orphan for so long she can only as 
as long as she can remember, and that's why she suffers a lot from depression, but I'm always there to support her. I also want to support Pesk. She needs all the support she can to overcome her depression. Thank you very much, Rosa. You're really a great person. No. On the other hand, <laughs> it really is. On the other hand, I was blinded and deluded by by the false relationship I had with Rhea. I should never have voted for you for you so that you were expelled before me. Nor should I have voted for Tess that day. I should have made a friendship with you and with Tess and Hunter. But I didn't look out for others when when I was on the same team with you. I should have stopped and started thinking about others. Please forgive me, Allie. Don't worry, Rosa. There's nothing to for There's nothing to forgive? Okay. <laughs> I guess. Oh. There's nothing to forgive. We just let ourselves be carried away by the game. That's all. Hey, there's <laughs> something I should tell you about. Sure, friend. What is it? When Rhea ruthlessly and vigorously betrayed you, reminded me when she pretended to be Tessa's friend, but... Oh, wait. I think it was supposed to be when I pretended to be Tessa. Oh, yeah, because... Oh, I forgot that was a plot line. Yeah, it was. <laughs> well, yeah, because, like, I was just spent trying to be nice, but now, like, I'm afraid. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but, but before I didn't know her well, I was never jealous because of her friendship with Hunter. I just felt a little uncomfortable. And then she and I became closer with the passing of time in the camp. And I really wanted to be her friend. And when the couple of challenges passed, I felt like a great connection and great chemistry with her. And that it grew even more when we met again at this hotel. What I once felt for Hunter is now how I feel for Tess. I really love her too much and I'm terrified of hurting her and losing her forever. This oh. is so fucking old, so I love these lesbians. <laughs> so cute! I love it! Yeah! <laughs> Ali, I know you wouldn't be able to hurt anyone, including Tess. You're not a bad person, like me. You're a very good person who's only had bad things happen to her. The only thing that matters is the paths you take. We, we drink? Um. And if Tess is... <laughs> um... <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't uh, know what that word was supposed to be. <laughs> I don't know either, but okay. I guess they drink. Yep. <laughs> we drink. And, and, and if Tess is very important to you, just go and talk to her when the time is right. She can understand. Do you really believe that? There's an old say saying that says, the most bitter truth is better than a sweet lie, but you don't lose anything by trying. Just think about it, my friend. The truth is the only way. I am very sure that nothing will change. I hope so, Rosa, and thanks for the support. You are m much more than a great person and a great friend. Seriously, you are a gift from God. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever you like, Allie, you are also a great person, w a great person with a heart of gold. And full of light, and I mean it. <laughs> this is so old. <laughs> Thank you very much, Rosa. What you say means a lot to me. Oh my gosh, this is too much. This is too much for me to take. My heart, my heart's too full right now with the, yes. the passion. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. It reminds me a lot of the time when you try to sacrifice yourself by taking Tessa's place in the ceremony when she was eliminated. That's what a true friend does! I would have done the same for Lake, and maybe for you. I know, and if we had interacted earlier, we could have made a difference. Hey, and will Hunter agree to your relationship with Tess? I hope so. True friends always agree through thick and thin. Hey, by the way, just like Hunter, I and Tess also believe you. Because you would never be capable of stealing other people's things. Thank you very much. I, I know that I count on your support as as you also know that you have mine. Hell yeah. You can bet. <laughs> <laughs> both, uh, both bump their fists and hug each other. Allie, Allie, before, before we go with Tess and Lake, can I read your horoscope? Sure. My sign is a Pisces. Takes Allie's hand to read her horoscope. She says that if you manage to find your own peace, that you will, that you will see that understanding with others will improve day after day. 
Wow, that must be a, a signal f for him to go deeper with Tess and tell her even more about how I feel about her. Oh, uh, yeah. We're getting more romance. I love romance. <laughs> yes, thank you. Oh my gosh. Yes, it is. Come on. Rosa Marie and Allie leave Tessa's room and return to Lake's room. Everything okay, girls? Yes, all good. Rosa, why were you crying a while ago? Nothing happened. Just that she couldn't handle Rhea's betrayal and she had to take a load off of her shoulders. That's right, friend. What Rhea did to me... What Rhea did to me was so low that I couldn't take it anymore, and I had to get it off my chest crying. Sometimes crying isn't bad, Rosa. It's a concept to, it's a concept to express a strong emotion, and Allie knows that. It's true, Tess. It reminds me a lot when we were both in the cave. Oh my god, I remember that scene! <laughs> Same! <laughs> okay, so what would we like to do now as the first action of our group of friends? We could go out into the street, and you will say where to go. I I think I think I know where to go. Come on, Allie and I want to show show you a very special place. Leaving Tessa's room, Lake sees Connor holding the portrait of a photo of Rhea, very sad and depressed upon learning of Rosa Maria's betrayal. Will you guys mm -hmm. wait for me for a while, please? Sure, Lake. We'll be here. Connor. Are you okay? I don't know. Oh, I understand. It's because of Rhea? She, she's like that little girl. I thought she was someone very special to me, but after what she did to your friend Rosa Maria, I don't, I, I don't know if everything she told me was true, and that she felt for me, or all that, or all that was li was lie, and was, and was only using me as a part of strategy, like she did with Rosa. I understand you, Connor. The four of us are as hurt as you are right now. What Rhea did was a very hard blow, especially for Rosa and for you. Yeah, that's right, Lake. We'll be right back. We'll go get s some air for a while. Sure, and have fun. We'll do that, and I hope you're better. I hope so. After Lake leaves the hotel along with Tess, Allie, and Rosa Maria, Connor, with the intense pain in his heart, turns the portrait with Rhea's photo upside down to avoid thinking about her for a while. Damn, you really fucked up this guy. Right? Fucking <laughs> Rhea, you missed, like, a big opportunity to get yourself a sugar daddy. I'm just saying. Right, exactly. The, the boat has sailed. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> later, <Such a> sh <laughs> later, Allie Tess. Rosa Maria and Lake went for a walk in the forest where Allie and Tess always went so that Rosa Maria and Lake could also meet, meet I guess, meet him. I, I think they meant the lake. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> and also so that they could interact without worries and to grow the friendship of the group of friends. Hey, girls. You, you, were, bo you, were, you were both right. This place is so beautiful. I should have come here sooner. Yes, it's my first time here, and here I can feel more free than ever. It's nothing compared to what we lived in the camp. In fact, here is much, much better since there's no challenges or serve alliances or anything that could separate us now that we're together, <laughs> as it should be been from the beginning. That's right. Here we can clarify, clarify our, idea, our ideas, and we can take a load off, a load off our shoulders. We can come when we need it mo most, or almost often. I'd like to see what lake looks, what the lake looks like. Apart from the fact that my name is in, my name is in English. Get <laughs> <laughs> it? Because they're at a lake, and her yeah. name's Lake. <laughs> uh, it took me a second, but I did get that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> of course, you're going to love Lake. Look. Wait, look, come. We we can see the lake and the great view. We can even throw some stones. Sounds good to me, Allie. Hey, Tess, can I talk to you alone now, please? Sure, Rosa, whenever you want. I talked to Allie a while ago to get to know her better. Now, now, now I'd like to talk to you to do the same, you know? 
Yes, I understand. Do you know, we hardly we, we hardly have interacted much, not to mention the time we, we kissed in the kissing challenge. I forgot that happened. Yeah? Hehehe, <laughs> <laughs> don't even mention it. But when we arrived at the camp, before you, you were a very serious and unpleasant person. But then you suddenly changed your mood, and you're so much cheerful. What happened to that radical change? Well... I well, I owe all of this to Allie and Hunter. But of all but above all to Allie. If it weren't for them, I would be stuck without expressing emotions and I would have no di no direction or direction. I had my ups and downs towards both of them, but not anymore. I wanted to be like this for the rest of my I wanted to be like this for the rest of my life, so I decided to open up to them so I could have my strength to get over my depression. Oh wow, that's cool. I really like that you were able to open up to Ellie and Hunter, too. I know. I also really like being able to open up with them. But more with Ellie. I owe them my life. But but she really is the love of my life. She seriously loves you as much as... As much as you love... As much as you love her, right? I love her too much that I would give my life for hers. Really. So she really means a lot to you, Tess. How can I ask you something... Hey, can I ask you something if you don't mind? Yeah, what is it? Would you like to tell me about your depression? I don't know if you want to hear it. Come on, tell me. I also I also want to help you get over it. Like I told Hunter, I'm a very good listener. Size. It's okay. You'll see, Rosa. It all started when I was it, it all started when I was an orphan with no family and no one to, and, and no one to take care of me about me. My well-being or my mental health. All my life, I've been I've been an orphan since I since I since I was little. But I accidentally said memory. Just memory. What's <laughs> <laughs> memory? I have never known my parents, and I have and I have lived and grew up most of my childhood and adolescence in an orphan in an orphanage, and nobody wanted to adopt me because they judged me. D judged me weird, and until I reached the age of majority, I fled from that place, and I and I and I lived been and I lived very independent, and I lived alone. I went to many psychologists so so they could help me, but all the efforts were in vain. Were in vain, and they gave up trying to help me until they reached the point of going to other psychologists without mentioning that I have also taken antidepressants so that I could at least I could at least. Can stop, can stop my depression for a moment. Then I came to the championship ch championships to, to turn my life around. But I but I tried to be hard on myself. But then I met Ali and Hunter, and that day and that day when Crystal mentioned that I am an orphan, hit me to the core, and I wanted to cry, and I wanted to cry inside. In the challenge after the merger, she she could never imagine that my depression would attack me. W would attack me even more so with the person I love very much, which is Allie. I told her I don't need her, but deep down I always need her. I should have never have reacted to her, re reacted like that to her, and I, and and and, 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 and I and I have felt very guilty for not, for for having hurt her, and I think about it every minute. And and the night when I was expelled, I I never felt so much pain in my heart. When I said goodbye to my friends and the person I love so much. Oh. <laughs> Why is Tessa's backstory so fucking sad? It really is. Like, jeez. I mean, they really like, let's just take this character and just throw a shit ton of trauma on them and then yeah. place them in a camp. <laughs> right. <laughs> oh my gosh. With tears in her eyes. Oh, sorry, Tess. I'm really sorry, I had no idea. Forgive me, hugs Tess. It's okay, Rosa, don't apologize. It was something that had to happen. You just continue with your role in the game. Crying. But seriously, I should have been there to support you as much as, as Allie and Hunter were supporting you. I feel so guilty for not doing it. I never should have voted for you at that ceremony. <laughs> don't worry, these are things that, that happen, but I... These are things that happen, but I would be very happy to have all your support as well that I can overcome my depression. And if it's any consolation with and if it's any consolation when Allie got kicked out, 
I think you did. I think you did yourself a huge favor by bringing the two of us together. Yippee! Wipes tears. <laughs> Yay! Wipes tears. It seems that way, and I think I also feel much better now that I've seen Lake again. I've always, I've always been by his, by her side, and and, and now I plan to do the same with you and Allie. That's fine with me. And does Rhea, does Rhea's betrayal st still hurt a lot? Yes, Tess. I can't stop thinking about about that all my time with her i thought i thought she was my friend and i would always be by her side and in, in, in whatever in, until the day you were you were expelled late lake and i went over with her to recover the perfume that connor gave her but she was just we're, we're wearing us all the fucking time just thinking about Rhea makes me want to smack her mother with bastards <laughs> I understand, Rosa. Even Allie and I thought that bitch was a good person, and we thought she, and, and and we thought she felt very needed when we were on the same same team. But we were only used as pawns in her in her chess game. But 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 the basis of betrayal that 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 she made you has no forgiveness. In the end, she turned out to be to be a little worse than you. Damn. That's exactly what I was thinking about. That asshole too. There, there, there are one, there are one for the other, and what, ha and what happened to that bastard? A few days ago, he recovered from his intoxication. Then he insulted Lake and Alley, and and at the moment, I gave him a good punch to not to knock out a tooth, to knock out a tooth, and and, and that night he was still the same jerk as always. And Alley confronted him by knocking the air out of him with the knee to the stomach and gave him a big slap. Knocking him to the ground, defending herself, and also Maggie's name. Let's, Let's go. go. This yes. is a, a Yule hate club. And <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> we, we don't like Yule at all. <laughs> exactly. That that was that was great. I'm very glad that you put him in his place, and also, and also, Ali did it for the most beautiful thing that beautiful thing that they defend the name of my friend Maggie. It already seems that everyone wants. To Wants to use that ass asshole as a punching bag. Good. Me too. Me too. Yes. I'm here. Let's just all use, let's just all use him as a punching bag here. Yeah. I volunteer. Okay. I volunteer. Punch him first. Yeah. <laughs> Girl, me too. <laughs> oh man. You know, that's what I said. Even I got tired of him continuing to treat that poor girl like scum. I know. In the kissing challenge, I wanted to break his mother at the point of bastards with such fury to that asshole. <sighs> Everyone was getting fed up with Yul in the camp, and Karma hit him the night he was expelled. And I imagine the same thing could happen for Rhea for Rhea for betraying you. I don't really like wishing ill on anyone, but yes, what Rhea did to me was so low that it will be impossible for me to forgive her. You're absolutely right, Rosa. Or Rose. I also want I also want to tell you that me and Allie also believe believe you as you as hunter belie believed you be be believe you because you never attended to steal things from other from others yes i know ali told me that too and thank you very much for believing me too tess i i tell i tell you something maybe i lost aiden as a friend james is still james ria's asshole betrayed me but looking on the bright side i gained a new friend H hunter hunter i saw my best friend lake again and gained two more friends you and ali that's true. Allie told me told me that, that that in life we shouldn't focus on the things we lost and better and better that we focus on the things we have and also on the things we've gained. That's right. Both bump their fists and hug each other. Yo, there's Gets a lot of fist bumping in this. Right? Every every like emotional scene ends with a fist bump and a hug. I love it. Yeah. Of the two. Gets nervous. Hey Tess. Ali has something very important to tell you. How important is that? It's better that you go with her, but before you say anything, just listen to her and and you'll surely understand her. It it'll be I'll be with Lake. Okay. Rosa Maria and Tess go to the edge of the lake where Ali and Lake are sitting. Hey Ali, Rosa told me that you have something important to tell me. Oh, of course, Tess. Come, we have to talk about it in private. Good luck, Allie. Allie and Tess go to a part of the woods to talk alone. 
Well, what's so important that you have to tell me? First of all, I just asked for you please not to get mad at me, okay? Okay, I hear you. Yeah, just as a side note, if anyone ever walked up to me like, Hey, so before I tell you, uh, I need you to promise not to be mad at me, that means I'm going to be absolutely pissed by the end of the day. Yeah, same. <laughs> You, you see, I couldn't sleep last night because I thought that when Rhea ruthlessly and vigorously betrayed Rosa, it reminded me that when she pretended to be your friend, Tess. Oh, when I pretended to be your friend, Tess. But I don't know you. I didn't know you very well before. I've never been jealous because of your friendship with Hunter. I just felt a little awkward. But when you and I got closer, as time went on at camp, I really wanted to be your friend. And when the couple challenges passed, I felt a great connection and chemistry towards you. And it, it grew even more when we met again at the hotel. What I once felt for Hunter is now how I feel for you, Tess. I really love you so much and I'm terrified of hurting you and losing you forever. I'm really sorry if I haven't told you before. Can you please forgive me, Tess? Tess was silent for about five seconds. Oh. Ali, I I won't say I'm upset, but I won't say I'm surprised either. From the beginning, I have seen your discomfort when, when Hunter was with me. He he was only kind to me when he found out about my depression. And you know and you know that. And that and then you did the same support support me, so I no longer be, be alone and I and, and I was before the camp and yes. I forgive you, Ali, because you are being honest and, and honesty and sincerity are, are the main basis of our relationship and our love to continue working as they have been doing before. And I am also very terrified of losing you. These lesbians are great. <laughs> you <Yuka! laughs> Thank you very much for forgiving me, Tess. I would never be able to betray you. <laughs> I know. I I, I I I know you never will, never will, my love. Woo! <laughs> and also, thanks for giving me one more chance. When did you lose the first opportunity? <gasps> oh my god! You just for three seconds. I love this book. <laughs> Same. Do you want us to go get Rosa and Lake and head back to the hotel? Yeah, okay, come on. Grab Sally's hand! <gasps> They're holding hands! Oh, oh my god! god. <laughs> <laughs> Leaving the forest, Ali, Tess, Rosa Maria, and Lake went to eat something at a nearby restaurant, and later in the, at sunset, the four of them returned to the hotel, but without realizing Yule was at the entrance of the hotel. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Not you again. God damn it. We can't have one moment in this goddamn thing. <laughs> 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 And, and now what does he want? Whatever it is, it doesn't come from good intentions. Get sarcastic. Hello, girls. Where have the four of you been? That doesn't matter to you. Get lost. What do you want now, yo? Hey, calm down. I just want to try to... What the fuck does that say? For Fra fraternize? Fraternalize with the Latina's what's her name? Oh my gosh. Her name is Rosa Maria and she wants nothing to do with you. What Ali said. Now leave me alone, you bastard. It doesn't matter, but you have to you don't have to be so aggressive with me if you don't know me well. Surely the low budget actress made you leave camp with your tail between your legs. How dare you? I don't want I don't want you to mention Rhea's treacherous snake in front of me like that again. And that and that way you treated my friend Maggie is enough for me, for me for what an asshole you, for me what an asshole you are. Now move if you don't want me to break your mother like I should have done from the beginning. Who, that freak? Rosa Maria, in rage, punches you in the nose, leaving him bloody. <laughs> oh my gosh! What's wrong with you, crazy? You broke my nose. I told you, asshole. You you already have me up up to the mother. Lunges at you while 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 the fence lift. Allie, Tess, and Lake try to separate Rosa Maria from Yule. Grabs Rosa Maria, 
Rosa, stop it! It's not worth it! Calm down! Come, let's go to the room so you can be calmer. Holding- Holding his bloody nose. Damn Latina. Now if you're not gonna finish it, you'll see. Disgusting thief. Shut up, yo! <laughs> what a scene. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> Allie, Tess, oh. and Lee take Rosa Maria to Lake's room so she can calm down after the hard time Yule gave her. I'm so sorry, girls. I couldn't contain myself, but I really had enough of it, and I really wanted to break his mother. You know what? That's fair. You know what? I wouldn't contain myself either if Yule was in the room. I mean, yeah. <laughs> Same. <laughs> Same. <laughs> it's okay, Rosa. Don't worry. Deep down, Yule deserves that and more. Yul always tries to bring, bring out our worst side, but there's always someone who puts him in his place, like like, like the two of us, and and, and, and you, Rosa, Rosa, and even Kai with the verbal attack that day. Hell yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah, he's just dying to be the center of attention, just because his parents still want to give him enough, and he does it in order to hurt others. Go. 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 Girl, girls are girls are absolutely right. He he he, al he always discriminates against others who don't even have enough balls to see themselves in the mirror. Rosa, I'll go see Connor how how Connor's doing. I hope he's a little better. Thanks, a mix. Oh, I think that's sure. just a thanks friend. <laughs> yeah, I think thanks. that didn't get translated. <laughs> oh, <laughs> rip. Thanks, friend. Thanks, friend. Friend. Well, 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 I'll be here for a while with Allie and Tess. Link leaves her room and goes to see Connor. Is something wrong with you, Rosa? It's nothing. I never tend to act violently. Don't apologize. The problem is you. The problem is you'll never knows when to shut up. P plus, plus, you are not the only person with ch temper issues. Allie and I often have them too. If I'm honest. Well, and I also wanted to be with you for a while. And as you know, I stayed for a while. To, I stayed for a while to get get to know you better one by one, and I also need to take this opportunity so what so what you you both for, so that you both forgive me. Why? Be because I hadn't been with you in our time at the camp. I had several opportunities, but I didn't take advantage of them, and I should have. And I should have told like that 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 we should that we should have been been there that we should have been there been there with you two and Hunter from the beginning. But Rhea inadvertently told me that you two were in an alliance with Hunter, and I believed her, but she was just using me to get far in the game until she got to the point of betraying me at the end. And one of the things that, that and one of the things I really regret is not interacting with you two, two before girls. It's okay, Rosa, don't worry. There's nothing to forgive. We just got carried away by the game that was supposed that and, and, and the suppo and the supposed love triangle that existed between me, Ali and Hunter. At, at, at first was not an alliance. It was just a situation and the three of us were dealing dealing with before the team merger. That's right. And Rhea's betrayal took us and Link as much as by surprise as they did to you. But listen, let's stop thinking about the camp and start talking about things we'll do together and always. There's one more opportunity for us to be to make more friends, and as I say before, I like meeting new players in my life. Exactly. Sometimes it's human to, to admit our mistakes, but it's not too late for us to still make a difference. And, and Rosa, with our support, support, and, and Lake, and Lake, we will always be there. We will always be there when you need us most, and we help each other. With tears in her eyes. Oh, thank you, girls. Thank you for making me feel better. Lake and I will do will do everything possible to make up for, for lost time from, from this moment. We are officially best friends. Let's go! Yay! Yay! It's like the, what is it, the Four Musketeers, right? Yeah. Yeah. No problem. And, thank, and thanks to you too, Rosa, for offering us your friendship. Without the doubt of the four of us would be the best of friends. Maybe Tess and I will really like to visit Mexico one day. Ooh. Seriously, you are both going to love it. It's one of the most wonderful countries in the world. I can imagine. I've heard that Mexico Mexico is very beautiful at this time of year. That's right. 
Allie, Tess, and Rosa Maria hug each other, and Lake comes back into her room. I'm back, girls. Can I join the hug, too? No. Of course, Lake. Come on. Allie, Tess, Rosa Maria, and Lake do a huge group hug. Aww. Hey guys, do you want to play video games with us? Of course, Allie. It's been a while since I was a mom. Huh? I think it's oh. supposed to be when I when I became a mom. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, Allie can teach both of you very well. She is a great mentor. It's my first time doing it, but it's okay. Allie, Tess, Rosa Maria, and Lake went to Tess's room to play video games together. Then they watched a couple of movies to pass the time, and suddenly it got dark. Girls, I'm not going to lie to you. This I'm not going to lie lie to you. This day I had a wonderful time. I should have done it earlier with you with you at the camp. You two are really cool. Uh sh oh yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. I never had so much fun before in my entire life, and more of my best friend and my two new friends. Then you'll always be as welcome in our room as, as we are in yours. Yeah, we'll have more time to do more things now that we have, a, have the advantage of this time together. It seems so, but now Rosa and I will have to go to sleep. Wait, wait, before she left, Allie and, Allie and I did something very special for ourselves. What is it? Oh! What? <laughs> what is it, girls? It shows four bracelets. They are friendship bracelets with our names. There's one for each of us. Green's for you, Lake. Purple is for you, Rosa. Orange is for Tess. And blue is for me. Aww! Wow, these are very precious. Thank you very much, girls. You're welcome. Allie and I took the liberty of, of making the bracelets and... and, and for making the bra bracelets, and they are a symbol of, of our great friendship that, that the four of us begin to create, and will keep us more than united for a lifetime. Let's go! Yay. They really are very cool. Thank you very much, and see you tomorrow, friends. Yes, until tomorrow, girls, and, and good night. <laughs> well, well, Al well, Allie, what do you think about the birth group of friends? I think it's like a dream come true. From the beginning, I liked them and always imagined being friends with Rosa and Lake, and also with you, Tess. Mm -hmm. I know, Allie. I really like them, too. I'm very happy about that. Well, what do you like to do to take advantage of this moment with, for, for the two of us? We, we can both dance for a while, my love. Ooh, shit. Ooh. Do you know how to Dancing. dance? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, but I can learn fast with you. Okay. Plays romantic music from her cell phone. First, put your one hand on my hip, and then put, then I'll put my hand on your shoulder like this. Grabs Tess by the shoulder. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Grabs Allie by the hip. I think this will be easy. Of course, you learn. Allie and Tess start dancing for a while until later in the night. Oh no! Not this again! No! No! <laughs> okay. Oh no, I can is do it bad? This. <laughs> yeah, yes. Okay, I can, no, I can do this, I can do this. Okay. Puts her hands behind Tess's neck. Yeah, wait, oh wait, no, 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 I was reading wrong. Puts, <laughs> puts her hands on Allie's hip. Do you want to make love again, Allie? I didn't see that when translating. <laughs> I was like, wait, why are you freaking out about it? This is the end of the book. Because <laughs> uh, of that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, puts her hands behind Tess's neck. Yes, Tess, I want to do it with you again. <laughs> Allie and Tess kiss passionately and go to the bedroom to make love together again in the lovely night of passion between them. Finn. <laughs> What a great way to end the story. You know, yeah. <laughs> I I really did not see that last part. So like, when you were freaking out, like, what, what are you freaking out about? They're just dancing. They're having a good moment. <laughs> I was like, well, yep. Yeah. And then I was like, it was like they were dancing and being cute. And it was like, now I want to have sex with you. <laughs> <laughs> <Never mind. laughs> 
Oh my god. <laughs> so, what you think? That was so awesome. I, I knew you would love it. Yes, it was so good. My, my, my first thought, like when you said lesbian, I was like, oh shit, no, maybe we can do like a Gwen X Courtney. And I'm like, wait a minute. Yeah. I wonder if that, like, Harem the Goat person has any more tests in Alley fanfictions, yep. and then oh, yep. they did, and I'm like, yep, you know what, I have to, I gotta translate this he, whole thing. Yeah, he actually just updated, he actually just made a new one as well. Yeah, I saw that one, but then I got like, <laughs> I was like, maybe, yeah. maybe not the new one. Yeah. <laughs> Well, if you guys would like to read this, I'll have both the Spanish uh, link and then also the English translated one. And I'll try to fix as many arrows, errors as possible. If there's any on there, I think yeah. you can leave a comment on there. Or maybe in the description telling me how dog shit I am at writing. But <laughs> <laughs> but uh, now it is uh, everyone's favorite time of uh, when I have my regulars on here is that we spin a wheel and it tells us how screwed we are the next time we record. <laughs> Now, I don't- okay, let me- I gotta open the right one, because I had a different one up here. <laughs> Oops. So, uh, Kenzie, as much as I would love to have you sh see this, uh, I think it slows down my computer, so yeah. the wheel doesn't actually spin, so don't worry, I will tell you the results <laughs> when it happens. Okay. okay. Alright, so as long as it doesn't land on Phoenix's Choice again, we'll do whatever it says. Alright, let's okay. see. Okay. Very pretty wheel. Oh, we gotta update these colors. Oh, oh, oh! Okay, we got the Noah X Cody story again. Oh my gosh! The, uh, learning to love you more. No, no, Co. Oh boy. <laughs> yeah, we are never escaping this couple. It's like every other story that we read. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah. But it's, it's, I mean, it's a really good book. It is, yeah. honestly. So I don't mind reading something that's good. Yeah, same. Like uh, certain <laughs> books we've uh, read before. Yeah. <laughs> <A DJX reader. laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. Uh, at least we know what we're getting into with this book. True. Yeah. True. <laughs> but, uh, but thank you, Kenzie, for joining me on this again. I, 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 it, it's always a pleasure to have you. <laughs> yes, you yeah. too. Yeah, I will. I will have Kenzie's stuff linked down below. You should definitely go to their channel and watch some of their stuff. Their stuff is pretty good, and they also make all my thumbnails. So if you're looking for a person to do that, to hit them. Up. Yep. But uh, but anyway, my name is Phoenix. That was Kenzie. We'll see you guys next time. Bye bye. bye.